Global Water Partnership, Central and Eastern Europe, put on an amazing summer school for us, Water and Sustainable Development. And this happened in Poland, and this was for people from the Central and Eastern European countries. And while we were there, we were talking about projects we wanted to do. Everyone was so motivated, so excited, but they, they just didn't know how to make this happen. And while we were there, we said, wow, we really need a network. We really need to continue this relationship with each other, continue these friendships. And we decided we would form a community. So we formed the Youth Water Community Central and Eastern Europe. Thank you to the help of GWP Central and Eastern Europe. Ankur, Antonella, they were our mentors while we were there. Thank you guys so much. Um, and also, so we started coming up with ideas what, are, what is needed in Central and Eastern Europe. And one of our members, um, Elvis from Albania, from Duras, Albania, he was telling us this story. He was telling us that there was news that uh, maybe a year ago, a man drowned in the um, Ishmi River in Duras, Albania. He drowned because there was so much plastic pollution that he just kind of got tangled in and couldn't escape. And he wanted, Elvis wanted to make an impact and he realized, okay, we need to clean up this plastic pollution. How can we do this? So this became our pilot project. We decided we need to clean up this river. So we came up with the project Fish Me Ish Me. <laughs> Funny name, catchy maybe, I don't know. <laughs> and what we want to do in this project is really empower the youth. So we want to start with youth empowerment, these are our missions, empower, uh, advocate, so we want youth involved in policy, in the government. We don't want us just, I mean, we have our voices, we need to be heard, so this is important. So empower, <laughs> advocate, and act. So that is our third plan, is to put youth-led projects at the forefront. And this is what we want to do in Duras. We want to start this project where we educate the students, we educate the uh, university students, and we have an event, a one-day event, where the whole community can come together, they can clean up the river, and then they can do fish me, ish me. They can start fishing the garbage, but after that they can fish for fish, and they can have a nice clean river they can enjoy their rivers and their watersheds. And we hope through this project, we will be able to scale this throughout Eastern Europe. And we really are excited to raise the voice of the Central and Eastern European uh, youth because this is lacking right now. How often do you hear about youth-led projects in Central and Eastern Europe? There's so many projects going on in Africa, Southeast Asia, Latin America, but we're, we're in Europe and we're lacking this part of our, you know, community, so that's where we come in. So we're excited. Fish me, ish me, yay! Thank you very much.